Hello, we will discuss types of gangrene in minutes. We have dry gangrene and wet gangrene. Dry gangrene in lower limb and wet gangrene in bowel. Mechanism dry gangrene due to arterial occlusion like sudden embolus or acute on top of chronic ischemia means thrombosis on top of atherosclerosis. Wet gangrene due to venous obstruction. The gross features, the dry gangrene, the gangrenous limb will be dry, shrunken, black, and mummified. But the wet gangrene, the intestine will be moist, soft, swollen, and rotten and dark. The putrefaction, limited due to very limited blood supply. And in wet gangrene, there is marked Putrefaction due to congestion, stuffing of organ with blood. Line of demarcation is very well appreciated in the dry gangrene, separating the healthy and gangrenous parts of the limb. In wet gangrene, no clear line of demarcation. Bacterial growth will be very limited in dry gangrene due to limited blood supply, and with gangrene, the bacteria will survive happily due to congestion of blood. The prognosis is better, of course, of in dry gangrene due to low bacteria growth and low septicemia. The wet gangrene will be of poorer prognosis due to profound toxemia and bacterial overgrowth. This is the feature of dry gangrene in one picture you see the line of demarcation is well drawn separating the healthy and the black mummified dry part in the small intestine you see here no line of demarcation and the organ is swollen and just dark with moisture. Thank you very much.